Hi, this video is a short demonstration of the SimpleSync module for Drupal, Drupal 7. Uh, my name is Andy Inman. You can contact me via my own site, netgenius.co.uk or via drupal.org. So what is SimpleSync? Well, it says here, an easy way to copy configuration changes between multiple site environments. So mainly focused on configuration changes, although in fact uh, it can be used also to make some uh, copying some content changes as well, but let's look at configuration first. Um, I have here my development site and my test site. Currently more or less identical, both of them, but they're independent. <clears throat> what I'm going to do is make some changes on one of the sites and use Simple Sync to copy those changes very easily across to the other. So here on the dev site, let's go into uh, ta a taxonomy list. We have here tags. It currently looks like that. Over on the test site, we have the same taxonomy list. Looks the same. <coughs> looks the same at the moment. So let's make some on here on the dev site. Going to make some changes. Um, move bananas to the top and just some random changes here, really. Uh, oranges down there. And right there like that, for example. So that's what we now have set up on dev. Switch over to test. All I need to do now is hit this link that says sync from dev. I get given a list of a summary of changes that are going to be made and all I need to do is hit the save button and that same structure now. So that structure is now identical to that one on the other side because it's been copied across. Uh, that's on taxonomy. Let's take a look at a permissions example. On the permissions page uh, on the dev site, uh, let's disable these three checkboxes and enable them. Enable them there. For authenticated user, save. On the test site, into permissions, scroll down. So that's that's as they were. We hit the sync from dev link. Scroll down again. It tells me, gives me a summary of what changes are going to be made. And when I hit the save button, those changes are, are saved locally. So now those permissions there are the same as those permissions there. Um, <clears throat> and I mentioned we could uh, we could use it for for synchronizing content um, where where the content already exists on both sites. So we can't add new nodes or, or new entities, but we can update an existing uh, node, for example. So this bit of content here which is node one on both sites. If I make a change, for example, to the title, so working on the dev site, make a change to the title, save those changes, go over to the test site, go over to the test site, into edit that node, logged out without wanting to. Edit that node on the test site. Yeah. Hit the sync from dev link. Tells me the change will be that the title will change from simple sync to simple sync updated. Save it. It's also displayed there. And that change was that change was copied across. So now the that node is, is identical on both sites as well. So that was it. A quick demonstration of the Simple Sync module. Um, here is the, the module page on Drupal.org. So you can download it there and, and try it out for yourself. If you have, find any issues, of course, please do raise them in the issue queue. That's the end of the video.